Q and U belong together in all words in English and in Spanish, so my pre-primary class decided to marry them. From making decorations with Q and U to having a real ceremony with letter girls, a quarterback, and a queen. Our kids just went you, all out. Will you have Q to be your husband to go wherever he is in words? Will you stand next to him in quiet times and quick times under a quilt? or standing on the play, whether quacking like a duck <coughs> or cooing like a quail, in sickness and in health, as long as you both shall live. You. Q, will you have you to be your wife, to go wherever she is in words? Will you stand next to her in quiet times and times, <coughs> under a quilt or standing on the quay? Whether quacking like a duck or cooing like a quail, in sickness and in health, and forsaking all other letters, will you be next to her in all words? As long as you both shall live, I do. <laughs> Even the Spanish teacher reminded us that Q and U also go together in Espanol. He wrote us a cute story about it. And we couldn't leave our music teacher behind. She got together a quintet and played for us the music to our song, the Q and U song. For the reception, we toasted to Nest Quick, we had a beautiful Q and U wedding cake, and of course the teachers just had fun with the kids during the reception, while eating croquetas with Q and U, tequeños, and our Nest Quick. We also did some writing. The kids came up with stories on how they thought Q and U met. Project-based learning is a great way to learn. The kids get so excited whenever they get to do any project like this. 
For more information, please email me at aperez at conchitaespinosa.com or follow me on Twitter at Ana Catasus. Thank you. I would love to hear from you. I'm Ana Perez and I'm a teacher.